little bit about just you guys had 28 threes that just weren't falling today or in the second half. And just about how you kind of live and die by that three sometimes. Yeah, today it didn't seem like it was falling too much, but um, the three-point shots help out a lot in, uh, in basketball. You know, you, you hit, hit two threes, you're going to go up by six. You miss them, and you said you live and die by them. Uh, um, to be honest with you, I don't think it was nothing that had to do with offense, because uh, that's a given. We're going to shoot threes, and we're going to play the way we play. It was, it was more defense. The first half, you shot 63%, and that's completely not just how basketball is. It's nothing we preach. It's nothing we about. about nothing we follow. Uh, we're a defensive team, so we just, um, you know, we kind of, we kind of forgot our identity a little bit at the uh, first half. Jerome, what, what adjustments did you make this second half? Or was just a question of maybe more intensity on the defensive end? Um, we had we had to match um, Central uh, Connecticut, you know, willpower and they pride. When guys out there playing with their heart, um, they had a lot of energy. They was together. Um, it's just, to be honest with you, they, they were the better team today. Um, but going in, going in the second half, we was just like, listen, we got to get stops. That's all it is. If we we, we string together a couple stops, we'll win the game. And uh, numerous of times, we was close to winning the game, and we just couldn't get the, get the big stops that we needed. Terrell, you had a 12 year team very early there in the first half. Did they make any adjustments on you, or, or how did they kind of slow you down a little bit after that? Um, well, they were breaking somebody from the baseline, so they double teamed me. So when I saw them double teaming me, I would pass it to open man. So that's basically all I can do. Try to the game by passing the ball. And you guys, you guys had a size advantage today. Um, I mean, was it in the game plan to, to try and take advantage of that? We just go with the flow of the game. If um, like the big men down, like um, down scoring, then you give them the ball. If the guards hot, you give them the ball. So we just try to work off each other. But it was it kind of wasn't the plan. But going into the game, I was telling them like y'all like y'all bigger than me, and I was you know we was trying to we was trying to use that as much as we can. You know, get the ball down to them because like y'all said, the first the first half he was scoring. Um, just because it was, it was one on one, and when they start bringing the double team, it kind of made it hard for them. But other than that, I mean, the adjustment that they made it was good by the coaches. No, no, it didn't seem like it was a lack of effort there on the defense. It seemed like they more so made a lot of really tough shots. But what kind of things? Is, what are some of the things that coach was saying in, in the huddle, trying to get you guys, I mean, execute better? I'm a, I love defense. To be honest with you, a lot of them shots wasn't tough. They had a lot of layups, a lot of layups, like. We just wasn't talking enough in transition. They had a lot of transition threes. They had a lot of transition layups. Um, I mean, I I just feel like we kind of lacked a little bit in defense. We wasn't we played D, but it wasn't the defense we play. It wasn't defense with South play. It's not the defense we practice every day. Uh, 94 feet, energized, height, everybody cheering each other on, every player, every minute. It wasn't it wasn't South defense. It was defense, but it wasn't defense with South defense to win. Ramon, Kyle and Alice had 23 points. What do you do that was so effective today? Um, he had shots. He, he, was, he, was, he was hitting, he, he had some good shots, you know. Someone was contested and someone wasn't. Uh, but he had a lot of good shots. And one thing you never can take away from a player is his skill. His skill set is he got a lead skill set. Ramon, you know, given some of the expectations around the team this season, how well you played this building over the last couple of years, how disappointed is this one? Uh, how disappointed? Yeah. Um, it's not really disappointing because it's the beginning, it's the beginning of the year. You know, uh, our mindset is not to lose at home. Uh, we lost, but you know, we put it, put it behind us and move forward. We got a game uh, Tuesday, so you know, this game is lost, and we're gonna go into practice and make our adjustments and whatever Coach uh, G tells us to do. You know, it's not really disappointing. It's just that we know what we kind of did. And we didn't kind of fix it as you know as players. You know what I'm saying? The coach was on us and he was telling us, but we just didn't kind of bring it together on the court. When you had a tie there late in the game, did you did you feel like you guys were in a good spot? Um, to be honest with you, the only time it wasn't kind of a good spot is at the beginning of the game when we was down twenty to nine. Other than that, I, I was telling them, like, listen, we get stops and we, we play together, we're gonna win the game. And when it came down to the, to when it came on the stretch, like two minutes, we was we, like you said, we was tired. We, just, we was right there to win again. It looked like a lot of times, even if you guys would make a big basket or something, 
they sprint back up the court and get like a real easy. I, that must have happened like six or seven times. Was it just like a lack of awareness or, or just, you know, in transition? Like I know you were mentioned transition defense earlier. Um, on defense, just wasn't my point tonight. Yeah, that's point blank. I, usually, usually, like transition defense, we do that all the time in practice. So there's no, like, we can't say that we wasn't aware of anything when we do it off like 24 7. So that was the main focus that Coach G talked about in practice. Like, this is what they do. The coach, their coach is going to let them play this year. And one thing they do is they get the ball out and go. I mean, they, we hit some good shots, and then they come down and hit bigger shots.